do you think it's important to have a planner or goal? So not all of you had one. If you wanted to buy something but you didn't have enough money, that, that's your goal is to get up to. Yeah, perfect. You need to know how much money you need for the things that you want. That's exactly right, all of you. Growing up, it was probably my parents were my biggest influencer. As a young child growing up, I remember that I was, you know, given pocket money. Having your children understanding finance and money is extremely important today. If you can get that instilled and some understanding in primary school and then through to secondary school. Even having the meetings with clients, they quite often say that, oh, actually, we haven't had a discussion with our children about inheritance tax planning or setting up investments for the children. You know, I'm passionate about financial education and our money saving habits are formed by the age of seven. It's why I wrote a children's book, Save Your Acorns. It's why I think it's important to give children pocket money. I think it's why it's important to teach them that there's opportunities to earn money and that's separate from chores and good manners and good behaviours. So, you know, don't get paid for tidying up the dinner table or loading the dishwasher, but, but maybe offering to clean grandma and grandma's car, that's a good way to start thinking about earning money. My oldest daughter, when she turned four, started to own pocket money. That's really powerful because A, you can start to have conversations about wants and needs. So you break down the conversation at the supermarket. Can I have that chocolate? Can I have that magazine? Because you can turn around and go, well, you've got pocket money, you can decide. I think teaching them about money often comes with quite a stigma or they think it might be too complicated or it's going to be too mathematical and it's going to be a bit boring for them. So to put it into a fun gameplay interactive session is really key. I think financial education is critical for young children and it's something we don't necessarily have enough time for in the national curriculum. Children are really impressionable at this young age and they are under intense peer pressure from society, from adverts and from their friends. So it's really important they know how to use their money safely and learn how to invest things um, because they don't necessarily learn that at home. I don't understand why that money is almost like a taboo subject because at the end of the day it should be discussed at the kitchen table amongst the whole families. So parents, grandparents and children.